Divisibility rules are very much handy while reducing any fraction or working with number. Okay. It saves very much time and is tendering children's calculation capacity. Okay. So here I am explaining about divisibility rule. The first comes divisibility by two. Okay. Any even number is divisible by two. For example, two, four, six, eight, seventy-eight, three hundred, forty-eight. All these numbers are even numbers. Okay. Why this number is even number? Because the unit place digit. is an even number okay this one is also an even number right so let us check 348 is divisible by 2 or not 348 okay if i divide by 2 like this 27 10 24 10 okay so it is divisible clear now i am telling Number another is divisible by 3 if sum of the digit of the number is divisible by 3 okay i am just illustrating with an example you can capture and understand clearly okay here i am giving first of all a number 75 okay i am just taking another thickness of the line okay 75 how will you say that 75 will be divisible by 3 in advance okay so it is very handy you can check the sum of the digit okay like it is 12 as 12 is divisible by 3 therefore this number is divisible by 3 okay why it is useful suppose i am taking a large number like this okay you can say very quickly that this number is divisible by 3 by checking the addition of the digits its digit okay and its divisibility like 3 plus 0 plus 1 plus 2 it is 6 as 6 is divisible by 3 therefore this number is also divisible by 3 you can check with the uh, actual division right i don't need it i am confirm and confident that this is divisible by 3 okay mm, 6 0 3 3 it is also divisible by 3 because sum of the Digit like this is twelve, and this twelve is divisible by three. Okay, I think you understand what I am telling. The next rule is divisibility by four. Okay, the rule of this divisible by four is that if the last two digit of any number is divisible by four, then the number is also divisible by four. Okay. i am writing first number 324 as this last two digit 24 is divisible by 4 because 4 6 ja 24 therefore 324 is also divisible by 4 if you make this number like this 4 5 3 2 4 you just only see the last two number if this number is divisible then by 4 then all the number And that, that this number is divisible by four. is very handy thing. Okay. You you can check it. Another example I am telling you, six five six. As fifty six is divisible, therefore this number is also divisible. Let us check this one. Six five six by four. Four one ja four two four four six ja twenty four and four four ja sixteen. You will get quotient one hundred sixty four. Okay. 
the next one come is the divisibility by 5 okay it is a very simple and very easy if the unit place number of any number is 0 or 5 then that number is divisible by 5 I am just giving an example 2 0 okay 3 4 5 you just see last digit it is 0 and is a 5 if you make this number like this 4 3 0 2 0 last number is 0 last digit is 0 therefore uh, this number is divisible by 5 very straight rule ok that means you have to only remember this if the unit place number is 0 or 5 then the number will be divisible by 5 okay. next come divisibility by 8 this divisibility rules I will not recommend to use because it is not so much handy because it is telling that if the last three digit for example I am telling one this number if last three digit is divisible by 8 then the number will be divisible by 8 it is only handy if the number is very large for example if number is like this 0 3 1 44 S then you will only check last this number whether it is divisible by 8 or not huh, then you will assure that this number will be divisible by 8 because 144 is divisible by 8 you can check it 8 1 ja 8 6 8 8 ja 64 though this number is divisible therefore all uh, this big, num big number is also divisible by 8 okay a number will be divisible by 9 if sum of its digit is divisible by 9 for example I am writing one number 72 7 plus 2 equal to 9 as this 9 is divisible by 9 therefore the number 72 is also divisible by 9 okay I am telling here another number this is a big number let us check whether the sum of its digit is divisible by 9 or not 7 plus 9 plus 2 plus 0 plus 9 plus 0 16 16 plus 2 18 18 plus 9 27 ok as 27 is divisible by 9 therefore this number is also divisible by 9 so we get the idea about the divisibility of a number in advance so it works very handy while calculating or working with number in mathematics right so this video will be very helpful I think okay